Our next guest is a Grammy-winning, Tony-nominated actress you know from shows like Modern Love, as well as the films The Wolf of Wall Street and Palm Springs. She stars in The Resort, which is streaming now on Peacock, with new episodes premiering Thursdays. Let's take a look. Estoy caliente. Hey, Emma, hey, look, where are you? Don't look for me. Don't look for me. Please welcome back to the show our friend Kristen Milioni. <laughs> welcome back. I'm so happy you're here. I'm so happy to be back. Thanks for having me. In the beginning of that clip, you said in Spanish, you were trying to say, I'm hot. That I'm hot. But you said, yeah, I'm horny. Yeah, they cut off the first part where I'm clearly in a wool blanket in like a tropical location, and then I say, I'm horny instead. By yeah. Accident. Is that indicative yeah. of your own Spanish uh, speaking skills? It's, it is. Yeah. Yeah. We, um, that was like, uh, we had been all hanging out at the beach during the weekend, and um, my co star, Luis. Gerardo Mendez, who's brilliant on the show, he had been teaching me and um, my other cast member, Nina Bloomgarden, uh, phrases not to say. <laughs> and one of them was estoy caliente, which just means I'm horny. And you think, but you think it would mean that I'm hot. And so I did it to make everyone laugh, like make the crew laugh. We were shooting in like a 200 degree fruit market, but they kept it, <laughs> <laughs> which is like That's sometimes a delight. Yeah, but also it made sense, because I think that she also wouldn't know Spanish. And yeah. she would also be like, oh, I'm horny. <laughs> this is a, a fantastic show with you and um, William Jackson Harper, who's a wonderful actor. Oh, well, I love and it. you're on a 10 year uh, wedding anniversary and you go to a resort, and then you start investigating a, a decades old murder. That's right. This is like a very fun idea. Yeah, well, <laughs> you'd think, but hijinks ensue. <laughs> they and do? that's the thing that they don't see coming. Yeah, they yeah. always, <laughs> you, almost everything you're in, hijinks do, in fact, ensue. Oh, I don't, I get, yeah. I, I don't go anywhere where there's not hijinks, <laughs> apparently. It's like not by choice, but yeah. every They follow time, you. The, they the follow me, they, it's yeah. true. The, yeah. um, they pursue, the hijinks <laughs> pursue. That's right, hijinks pursue. You, um, <laughs> you filmed in uh, Puerto Rico. Yes. Um, which must have been incredibly beautiful. How did you find Wonderful. it? Wonderful. Um, how did I find it? I took a plane there. Yeah. And then. And that's um, something like the airlines do, right? And they like they. To much to you my surprise. You buy the ticket, but they like yeah, find it. Yeah, and I was it. like, do you guys. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, I was like, and you guys know how to find this? Or... And they were like, ma'am, get out of the, the, the pilot's cabin. Um, yeah. And I was like, can I also have a drink? No, I don't know. That's like a stupid yeah, that's old right. joke. Pilots don't drink. Um, <laughs> uh, oh my God. <laughs> smash. Can I? Um, yeah, no, they found it for me. And then I got there. Um, and I, I really liked it. It's a brutal place to shoot. Yes. I mean, I feel silly ever being like, oh, the, sh the, the shooting was, oh, it was hard. <laughs> like, it's a, an incredible job. But yeah, every day is but like shooting, 100 degrees. Shooting in nice air conditioned places is, is hard. Great. It's totally. No, like, like they're long days. They're and long you, days, and yeah. But, and, uh, but we were like in the jungle, 100 degree every day. Our incredible crew pushing like giant cranes up mudslides. We would have to hold for rain because it was a, a literal rainforest. And um, giant so bugs. So that's on you. Like everything. So that's actually on us. Yeah. And you're right about that. When you yeah. go to a rainforest, you're like, oh, rain. Yeah, and I was like, like, rain? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. This is false advertising. Did you come but, right out of quarantine and go into shooting the show? Oh, yes. So yeah. uh, when I landed in Puerto Rico, I was tested for COVID and then went to go visit the set and um, kept my mask on because I was feeling like a little weird even though we were shooting outside and I thought it was because I had just been on a plane and like sure enough, 20 minutes later, they were like, oh, you have COVID right this way. <laughs> and they put me in a hotel room for 12 days that I wasn't allowed to leave. And it was very dark and I faced off with my shadow self and then, um, <laughs> and then we were back. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I mean, it's incredibly, I mean, I, that's uh, another thing where you think like, oh, if you're gonna be in a hotel for 12 days, it's gotta be Puerto Rico. But I bet even the beautiful views make no difference after like the first six hours. Well, oh, because yes, 
also because the hotel I was in, I, I, we all lived in apartments, but you know, for the first couple of days, I landed at this hotel that was above a casino and is like known for bachelorette parties. Yeah. So I was like upstairs, like the little kid in the secret garden, <laughs> and like they, there were like you know, drunk bachelorettes on the beach being like. Woo! And then like a DJ on the beach just playing like the same song by the weekend. If I hear blinding lights by the weekend one more time, like I already started to turn into like a Gotham villain in that room where I just was like, like you just, you're, it's 12 days not leaving a single room. I would like look outside, I would peek out the window like all drawn in like a white sweaty bath bathrobe from the hotel. I like to dark. think there were bachelorette parties going to the front desk and complaining about <laughs> yeah. this woman yeah. who was like yeah. peeking exactly. out. Like, we're trying yeah. to have fun. Yeah, exactly. And there's a dead woman. <laughs> exactly. There's yeah. a ghost of a dead yeah. woman. This place, we were told this place was haunted when we booked it on Groupon or whatever. Like, yeah, I basically just would like glide into view and glare at them while like shaking violently <laughs> and coughing into my arm. And the TV was broken. I could only watch this one. Then the TV was broken, <laughs> Seth. Oh my God. We all was, had really hard quarantines. It was crazy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that sounds terrible. But the TV was broken, so I could only watch A League of Their Own over and over and over again. <laughs> And so I was, which I love A League of Their Own. Yeah. But I was just crying all the time, like in a bathrobe, sweating. This is crazy. I mean, so your nightmare right now would be uh, the weekend opening for A League <laughs> yeah. of Their Own. Exactly. I would be like, <laughs> like just, yeah. I would start shivering. We've talked about uh, your desert work in films such as uh, Palm Spring, <laughs> and now you've, you're doing some jungle work. That's right. Do you have a preference of where to shoot? Because they both seem like pretty Intense. trying, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, uh, the jungle. I like the jungle. Oh, okay, that's yeah. nice to hear. I like it. I love a tree. I, I love a tree. <laughs> no, but I do. I love. It. It's it's beautiful. It's there's so many great smells. Oh. There's it's like <laughs> what a sales pitch. <laughs> do you? Does yeah, the... you guys are gonna love the jungle. If you like smells, <laughs> you're and rain and bugs and mud. You are gonna love the jungle. But I actually, I really do like the jungle. The desert, I don't trust. Yeah. Why are we out there? We don't belong there. I agree. That's like when we're in a plane. Why are we up there? We don't belong there. We're not birds, Seth. <laughs> I don't have to tell you. You don't have to tell me. I've yeah. been saying that from the beginning. <laughs> I was the yeah. first guy who noticed, remember? I, I forgot. Like... That's right. You were like, wait a second. <laughs> wait, no. Yeah. No, it's, but yeah, the desert feels like that where I'm like, there's no water. It's hot. Yeah. We're not here. Even lizards have trouble here. Why yeah. are we here? Right. Anybody who's thriving in the desert looks super weird. Looks weird. Sp spiders underground. Yeah. Uh, spiky, uh, uh, spiky shrubs. Uh, spiky shrubs. Spiky uh, shrubs. No thank you, spiky no, shrub. No thanks, yeah. I'm barely okay with normal shrubs. That's right, yeah. <laughs> if I've said it once, I've said it a thousand times, I don't mess with spiky shrubs no. anymore. Yeah. And yeah. obviously, yeah. you don't want to be messed with, or yeah, else you no. wouldn't have evolved into being spiky. Thank you, so why are we here? Yeah, well, I think we've made our so, case against yeah. the desert. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm so, proudly coming out as anti-desert. You definitely are, probably. Yeah. Dusty. <laughs> well, I, do, you love, not, no. do you love sand in Look, your eyes? Some people in the desert watch this show enough. Well, I have a. Yeah, I, <laughs> I do have questions about living in the desert, but we don't have to get into it now. Maybe next time. Okay. All right. <laughs> it's this the best having you here. Thank I you so much, here. you guys. Thanks. That's Kristen Milioti. The resort is streaming now on Peacock with new episodes of the